Hi guys, welcome to another exciting episode. It's your man Calculus the Engineer and today we're going to discuss mass excavation of a short video and our case study is a site in uh, Nairobi where we had expansive soils on site. It is a residential development and you're going to have a one-story maze on it. So we did three trial pits just to try and determine the average depth of the black cotton soil which was determined to be about 1.2 to 1.3 meter deep. So we did uh, after the the results were out then we decided to mass excavate the entire plinth area of the house uh, using a, an excavator with a bucket at the edge you can also use a backhoe excavator or a shovel to do this depending on how tight the site is the condition of the soil if it's wet or dry and uh, of course looking at the time factor and uh, finances so we used uh, an excavator for this and uh, the entire plinth area was uh, was excavated where we met uh, we hit laterite gravel at about 1.2 meter depth and you'll find that uh, in such sites you need to replace the material with an expansive soil after excavation is done in areas where you're not going to put up anything and you just needed working space during the excavation so that uh, your workers can get enough room to to work on the foundation so we are going to cover the other provisions that are made in uh, during the excavation and construction of foundations in uh, expansive soils in future videos guys please share subscribe and comment on the videos it helps with the algorithm so that we get our videos out there to assist those who might need direction or just be informed on such matters. Until next time, keep grinding and growing.